I'm Nixie Pixel and you're watching OS Alt, your source for open source. AIM, IRC, MSN, ICQ, when you're seeing these letters, you're either playing Scrabble or sending instant messages. If you're looking for a client to do the latter, I'm here to help. Brought to you by HostGator. Say you chat with Harry on AOL and Sally on Google Talk. You need to install individual programs and run those programs separately to communicate with both of them at the same time. Or you could just use Pigeon. It's a free and open source multi-protocol chat program. With Pigeon, you can talk with all your friends using just one standalone application. It'd be almost like Harry met Sally. There are installers for both Windows and Mac, and depending on what Linux distro you have, you can find Pigeon in the repositories. For instance, in most versions of Ubuntu, it's available in the Software Center. However, the latest version isn't usually there, so Pigeon walks you through installing the latest version via PPA, and it looks something like this. The thing I find cool about Pigeon, aside from a single interface for all of the chat protocols, is that it standardizes file transfers, away messages, and even smiley faces, so you don't have to painstakingly navigate different user interfaces with every login you use. This makes management of numerous chat accounts really easy, and you still have access to customize each of your profiles and settings inside Pigeon if you want. There's tons of plugins to make Pigeon potentially outperform any IM client out there, like Twitter and Last.fm integration, and LED keyboard notifications. It also has the ability to save sessions and open windows, encrypted chats and chat logs even when the keys are compromised. Oh, and we can't forget plugins that let you add Xfire, Skype, Battle.net, and even OkCupid in the mix. As far as managing your various chat profiles along with all the bells and whistles, Pigeon is a no-brainer. In fact, if you still use software from ICQ, I think you're doing it wrong. Pigeon allows you to log in to almost any account that you can think of. Yes, even the shameful accounts like Fine Honey 420 that you made in high school. <laughs> I totally didn't make that account, that was just, yeah. If programmers deserve to be rewarded for creating innovative programs, by the same token, they deserve to be punished if they restrict the use of these programs. Thanks for watching OS Alt. Be sure to subscribe so you don't miss next Friday's episode of All Things Open Source. Hey, hey, ASL. <laughs>